Well, hello guys. Welcome back to another episode of Everyday EDC. Let me get a drink here. Let us enjoy this moment. <sighs> All right. So clearly we got an unboxing for you. I don't know why I waited for the video to start to take a drink, but that's the world we live in, I guess. And I don't know, there it is. I was kind of buying time. Because this is my unboxing knife, the Kershaw Launch 10. Let's see what's in here, guys. This could be really big. Or this could just be another whatever. I don't I don't really know what it is yet. I think I know. No, I, I actually have no idea. I never know how to open these boxes. Freaking love this thing as an unboxing knife, by the way. Is this the big daddy? Nope. Oh, no, but this is a big daddy. <gasps> oh, goodness. This is a wee. Those of you that know me will know why I'm so excited and can probably tell me exactly what this is before I show you. But whew, the day has come for one of my grail knives to enter the clutches of my hand. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a Wii. This Wii has, what the hell is this? Oh, cool, it has a, I don't know why you'd do that, but he uh, left the receipt in there. Dude must take care of his stuff. That makes me even more confident in this guy. Oh, oh, oh. Do you guys know what this guy is? Oh my god! This is the perfectly centered, perfectly heavy and slightly overbuilt, perfect fuller with a cutout and just semi-contoured scales and an awesome finish. Look at that. This is even the model that I wanted to get my hands on. This flame anno and wait for it. Oh. So, those of you that don't know the channel or are new to the channel don't know how much I've been dying to get my hands on the Wii Malice. Oh my gosh, this was one of my holy trinity of knives. I had the Shaman, the Super Freak, and then the Wii Malice. And oh, does this deliver. Does this freaking deliver. Yeah. I, I, oh. <laughs> No freaking words. Let's let's look at this a little bit more in depth. So we got this really cool flame anno on the titanium with a backspacer that's gymmed with the same freaking flame anno. And then even more flame anno on the pocket clip and the frame lock. Then we have this fuller that comes through with holes in it, but it's like a fuller but a cutout. It's pretty sweet. And then this awesomely ground flat blade or flat grind. And is it a flat grind? Yeah, flat grind. And oh, 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 Papa's got a new bag. So even the action isn't drop shut, which tells me that there's, I think he had a mark somewhere on here. Where was the mark? He said there was a mark and I don't even see it. So if there is one, I'm not mad about it because I don't see it. This thing is... A little bit more lean than I expect in the pictures. The pictures make it look really, really chunky, and it is. This is a chunky boy, but it's not like too chunky. Oh gosh, this thing is everything that I dreamed of. <laughs> I'm geeking out over this, and I can't help it. I the best part about this is that I had no idea this was coming in. Um, I thought this was. I have another really, really big knife coming in, and I was really excited for that. But this thing, oh, this thing is awesome. To put it in size reference, there's my Kershaw Launch 10. And so you guys know, I traded the Wii Mini Buster for this guy. Um, it's I got the Mini Buster at a, at, a, at a raffle, and I got lucky with like a $45 or $50 buy-in, and I won the Mini Buster. But uh, I didn't want to spend money 
<laughs> if I could help it, on the Malice, right? And most of the Malice, like, I, I don't even know if they're in stock in most places. Most places, they're out of stock, especially this Flame Ano version. And rightfully so. This thing is awesome. You can reverse flick it. And the detent is actually kind of strong, and it feels good. See what I mean? The detent's kind of strong, and I'm pressing on the frame lock, I think. That's what it was. I was pressing on the frame lock to get to that. See? Yeah, so I got to reposition myself off the frame lock to get it. The, the thumb flip doesn't work as well, but the reverse flick works just fine. The flipper tab works just fine. And this thing fires. It's not super hard. It's actually a little tight. I bet if I put some oil in there, it's going to be fine. But listen, just fires hard as hell. Now, I locked up most of my oil. I like cleaned all this up and tried to give myself a decent working space. But I do have some of this Benchmade Blue Lube. Let's see what this does. Let's just add a drop. All right. Don't want to use too much. Let that work in a little bit. Yeah. This thing is so awesome. And so in my top knives now. This thing is freaking great. Sorry for being so over the top. Those of you, once again, that know me know how much I've been dying to get my hands on this, and I am so stoked that I did. I understand why this is a hard knife to come by, and it makes sense, because it is everything that I had hoped for, and then some. I'm going to give you guys long-term updates, reviews. I'll figure out how to do the thumb flick on it. I just can't get leverage in it, but oh, this thing is good. Do you guys want to see a cut test? I do. And then it's going to go in my pocket, and I'm going to carry the living crap out of this. Let's see here. I made cut test paper, by the way. Just <laughs> I didn't make it. I just cut the paper in half. All right. Regular grip. Yes. Choked up grip. Oh, this is my Wee Malice. This is my Wee Malice. There are many like it, but this one is mine. And... I'm not going to say this is a forever knife, but I have chased this knife for so long that I really, really think it will be. I don't see anything that makes me want... This thing is everything that I love in a knife. This actually has some shaman-like qualities, in my opinion. Some of you may disagree. The lines, even though it's straight, it's a little bit of an arc. Tiny, slight arc. has some shaman-like qualities there. The choke-up position, there's no thumb ramp. Shaman like qualities. Contoured scales. Shaman like qualities. But it has this fuller and it's all titanium. And uh, this is awesome. So that is my over the top unboxing of the Wee Malice. Guys, I'm so happy. <laughs> my name is Tyler. This has been Everyday EDC. You guys stay sharp, stay safe. Have a great freaking day, guys. Hey, guys. Thank you so much for watching. It genuinely means a lot. If you liked what you saw, please subscribe, hit the thumbs up, leave a comment. If you didn't like it, give me some feedback in the comments below and hit that thumbs down button. In case you guys don't know, I do have a Patreon, which will be listed right here. In that Patreon, we're giving bi-monthly giveaways to just the Patreons based on the number of Patreons that we have in the Patreon. We will also be giving discounts on all the knives that I sell based on the number of Patreons. My name is Tyler. This is Everyday EDC. You guys stay sharp, stay safe, and have a great day.